Firefighters are asking everyone to avoid part of downtown Topeka as they work to put out a fire at a building. It happened at the Trails Art Gallery on North Kansas Avenue. The flames engulfed the building, sending plumes of smoke into the air visible for miles. This is the second time that same building has caught fire. And Hannah Brandt has been at the scene all night. She joins us live now from there. Hannah. Yeah, Brooke, Jace, this used to be the Trails Art Gallery here until it was engulfed in flames. Those flames are out now, but firefighters are still here working to make sure that they don't reignite. Just before 7 tonight, Topeka firefighters got a call about a building fire on Kansas Avenue. They arrived to find the Trails Art Gallery being swallowed in flames. They rushed to put out the fire as people from the apartment buildings next door poured onto the streets to watch. I talked with the man who called in the fire and a woman who lives in the apartment next door. Began to see a little smoke, decided it was time to look around, and uh, I went outside and saw the building, uh, had some smoke coming out of it. Called 911, the fire trucks were there immediately, and um, the flames just took off after them. So, what did you think when you came outside and saw I couldn't believe it. I'd never seen a fire that bright, that high, that hot in my life. I don't know all the people that have the booths in there, but the people that own the building are really good, nice people, and um, we'll, you know, we'll do whatever we can to help them out, see what needs to happen. So. Firefighters say no one was hurt in that fire. Investigators are working to figure out exactly what sparked it. And earlier, I did talk to the owner of the Trails Art Gallery. He stood here in shock as he watched his life's work burn down for the second time. Live from downtown Topeka, Hannah Brandt, KSNT News. All right, KSNT was first to alert you about that fire, and you can get news that matters most when it's happening by downloading the KSNT mobile app.